What is up everybody? In this video, we're going to be reacting to something a little bit different. So, um, they have a Facebook page and a YouTube page. They are called the Alternate Reality Movies. Um, so on their Facebook page is Alternate Reality, well, it's actually called Alternate Reality Media. Um, that's what they call their YouTube channel, but you should go check out their page because they have a lot of cool, um, fan-made content and stuff. But what we're going to be reacting to today is the thing that they made today, which they've made a bunch of these, but they're like alternate reality superhero fan posters, like from like the 60s, 70s, and 80s, if any of these like 60s, 70s, and 80s stars were to play these iconic Marvel heroes. So the first picture we got is, we'll see, we got, looks like Aquaman, Catwoman, Green Arrow, Two-Face, the Riddler, and the Joker. So playing Aquaman would be William Shatner, um, playing Catwoman would be Nichelle Nicholas? Nichelle Nicholas? I hope I got that right. Hope I'm not butchering that name wrong. Let me know in the comments below. Um, uh, who's... Green Arrow is played by Michael Douglas. No other than Michael Douglas. Actually, it's funny because it looks like him, but I don't ever remember him having a beard or anything like that, so. Um, Al Pacino, uh, would be Two-Faced, which I could see, I could see, Shout out to my little friend! Ding! Heads, ah, you get to live, you know, something like that. Uh, that'd be that'd be funny. Uh, Gene Wilder would be the Joker. It's or not the Joker, the Riddler. My bad, not the Joker, Riddler. Um, but some of these actors have died and passed away. But seeing them, like, it would be interesting to see if they actually would, like, how their um, I don't know how they would portray that character. You know, um, that would be interesting to see if they were still alive. If some of these people were still alive, there are some in here who are who have passed. Um, but it would be interesting to see. William Defoe is the Joker. A lot of people have been saying William Defoe could be a pretty good Joker. I could see him playing a, a good Joker part in another, in a, like a Batman movie or something like that. Um, so the next one we have, we have The Flash, Green Lantern, Cyborg, Martian Manhunter, The Joker again, and Sinestro. So playing The Flash is David Cassidy. I don't really know much about David Cassidy. Um, Green Lantern would be Harrison Ford. Now that would be an interesting role for him to play because he's played Indiana Jones and he's played Star Wars so that would be another like uh space kind of acting that he would that he could do um he's a little bit old now but back in the day if he could that'd be kind of interesting I think um Lawrence Fishburne Lawrence Fishburne could be um uh cyborg that'd be interesting have a have a cyborg movie but you know all these people are older now guys so um but it would be cool to see what they'd look like in their prime if they actually were like, oh, hey, let's make a movie out of this, you know, out of this hero, and you can play this and make a series out of it and something, you know. Um, Karim, Karim Abal Jabbar, hopefully I'm saying that right, as Martian Manhunter. Um, Gene Wilder is the Joker. I don't know if I can see Gene Wilder being a Joker. No, not if I can do that. And then David Naveen as Sinestro. That's a that's a interesting. Um, all right. So next we have the Superman franchise. We got Clark Kent, Superman, Lois Lane, Wonder Woman, Lex Luthor, and Supergirl. Um, so playing Clark Kent is Warren Betty or Betty, Betty. Betty, Betty, something like that. Um, he's playing Clark Kent. He's also playing Superman. That'd be interesting. Um, Sally Field as Lois Lane. That would be really interesting considering Sally Field has played Aunt May before. And uh, you're like, mm, yeah. So um, her as Lois Lane. I could I could kind of see it. Um, and then we got Jackie. Or Jackie. Yeah, Jack, Jackie. Um, if I could get these names right, that'd be great. Um, Kate Jackson as a Wonder Woman. Um, and then we got Telly Sub. Valas, Telly Savalas, hopefully I'm saying that right, as Lex Luthor, and then we got Farrah Fawcett um, as Supergirl, so that rounds out the uh, the Superman thing, or the, you know, justice thing, um, so this is, and the ne my next one, this is my favorite one, favorite picture they've done, um, this is the Batman family, the Bat family, um, so being Bruce Wayne would be Paul Newman, uh, I could see, I could see Paul Newman being Bruce Wayne and Batman. Um, he's also Batman. Um, Mark Hamill as Robin. That's interesting, considering he's the Joker. <laughs> so I'm like, mm, yeah. Um, but that's uh, that's really that's really cool how they made that. Um, and then we got uh, so literally the Star Wars characters could play Batman characters. <laughs> um, we got Alec Guinness as Alfred. I could see Alec Guinness being Alfred. And then we got Carrie Fisher as Batgirl. Yep, I could see that one. And then last but not least, we got Frank Sin Frank Sinatra as the Joker. 
yeah, that I don't I don't know if I could I don't know if I could see Frank Sinatra being the Joker, guys. That's just no, that's just me. Anyway, so next is the uh, so we got Sydney Poiliter Poiliter. Hopefully, I'm saying that right as Black Panther, and then we've got Susan Sarandon as the Wasp. I could see it. I could see it. Um, uh, R.I.P. Carl Weathers. But you could be the Falcon, man. You could be the Falcon. Oh, uh, that's crazy. And then we got Jane Fonda as Captain Marvel. Ooh, she's looking good. And then we got Anna Margaret as the Scarlet Witch. And we got Dustin Hoffman as Bruce Banner. So that'd be... I could see Dustin Hoffman pulling off Bruce Banner. I could. Okay. Next picture is we got Mr. T as War Machine. <laughs> uh, and then we got Bruce Lee as Shang-Chi. That'd be... I could see that. And then, hey, look. J wait. James Brolin, I guess James, James Brolin, not Josh Brolin. Is James Josh's brother, or is that just another name for him? I don't know, but anyway, it says James Brolin, Thanos. Maybe they meant to put Josh. I, I have no idea. Or James, I don't know, guys. Anyway, moving on. Uh, we don't know who played Red Skull. Um, I really, I, yeah, there's question marks on there, so we don't know. Um, Alan Rickman as Loki. A young Alan Rickman as Loki, but I could see it. I could see him playing Yoki. Yeah. I could see him playing Yoki. Loki, oh good lord, I can't talk today, guys. Um, and then Charles Heston as Odin. I could, I could see Charles Heston playing Odin. All right, moving on. We have got um, Vincent Price as Doctor Strange. We got Michael J. Fox as Spider Man. I can see Michael J. A young Michael J. Fox playing Spider Man. I can see that. Um, we got Bill Murray as Ant Man. All right, all right. Um, we got Ra Rochelle Welch as Black Widow. And we got Chuck Norris as the Winter Soldier. Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. David Bowie as Vision. Definitely can see that one. Um, let's see. And then this is my this is the last one, guys. But this is my favorite one. So we have Burt Reynolds as Iron Man. I could see Burt Reynolds playing Iron Man. I could see him playing a Tony Stark. Arnold Schwarzenegger as Thor. I could see that. Give me back my hammer! Yeah, I could totally see that. I could totally see him playing Thor. Lou Ferrigno, the Hulk. Well, you know what's funny? Lou Ferrigno did play the Hulk, so he's reprising his role. Um, and then we've got Alan Ada, Alda as Hawkeye. Eh, okay. Clint Eastwood as Nick Fury. I could see that. I could see that. And last but not least, Robert Redford as Captain America. A young Robert Redford as Captain America, no less. But it is funny because he... Hmm, excuse me. He actually is in one of the um, Captain America movies, and I believe that's the Winter Soldier, Captain America Winter Soldier. I think that's what which one he's in. I could be wrong. Um, but yeah, those are the alternate reality movie posters, guys. And um, go check out their page. Their page is awesome. They got some really cool stuff. I'm actually about to check out their YouTube videos because I have some pretty cool stuff on there as well. But, um, yeah, guys, that's awesome. There are more. They're making more things. Like, um, I was scrolling today, and they had, what did they have? They had, uh... They had Robert De Niro as, like, the Penguin, and then they had uh, Julia Moore as Poison Ivy, and then they had Goldie Hawn as Harley Quinn, you know, just stuff like that. It's it's really funny and stuff to see. Like, oh, I could see that, you know, actor pulling off that character back in the day if it, we, you know, they thought of it back then, but, you know, uh, yeah. But anyway, guys, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. Um, let me know down in the comments what you guys think, like, uh, check out their page and uh, go support them because they're really, really cool. If you guys enjoyed more stuff like this, let me know down in the comments below and I can see if I can find some more alternate reality or AI reality pictures and stuff. And I may react to some of the... Actually, I might react to one of their videos, to be honest with you. I might do that. Um, but anyway, guys, with that being said, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, share, and subscribe. If you guys did not enjoy this video, hit the dislike button, subscribe, and share, and I will see you all in the next video.